Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new. It's currently at 10.09 p.m. and you might be thinking why am I starting a vlog so late? But I wanted to show you guys kind of my night time slash evening routine, just kind of what I do. Um, I have a lot of things to do tonight actually. I have some like homework to work on. I need to print some farm sheets for my pharmacology um, like notebook thing that we have to do of all the different drugs. Um, I have been kind of planning a trip. I've been talking to my friend Maddie. Um, me and Seth and Bailey want to go on a road trip and um, I don't really know exactly where we want to go yet. I had originally planned for Colorado. Sorry if you can hear Seth in there. Um, playing his game, but I had originally planned Colorado and basically like a cross-country trip But we kind of thought with a three-year-old that is potty training um, By that time she should be potty trained But just like a long trip like that would be kind of hard because we would have to stop so many times so Trying to find somewhere closer, but it's actually really hard because we live in Virginia And I just feel like there's not really much on the East Coast that's like super like adventurous and cool and three-year-old friendly um, so we're trying to to think of different places to go um, with a three-year-old so doing that tonight um, so I've been like checking out Airbnb stuff like that because we don't want to take a plane anywhere right now and we don't really want to go to a super crowded place um, but we do want some sort of vacation because literally we already have the time off and the dates picked and everything we just need to figure out where we want to go so that is happening tonight I have several different things to organize um, like in my office and everything I need to shower and start packing our bags for this weekend we're gonna head to the lake um, that will be a separate vlog but I will be vlogging the lake this weekend um, like actually vlogging vlogging like the whole weekend because I feel like that'd be really fun so hopefully I get to do that um, I don't want to speak and say that I for sure will but I'm definitely gonna try um, so have a lot of stuff to do this evening I also have some school related stuff I don't know if I said that already but gonna try to get all that stuff done um, yeah, so thank you guys so much for clicking on this video. It seriously means a lot to me. Um, what else was I gonna say? <laughs> I don't even know. I'm gonna show you guys a couple like rooms and stuff in our house that I've sort of been working on. We have a lot of projects going on right now. Sorry this intro is super long. Um, I just like I haven't actually like talked to you guys in a very long time, honestly. Um, an update on the ER thing I'm feeling a lot better and I got a lot of comments saying that it was probably caffeine stuff like that but the weird thing is I know I showed like some caffeine and stuff in that video but honestly I didn't have that much caffeine that day I didn't end up drinking the drinks that I took with me and I didn't end up drinking much of my coffee so it was really weird because normally I have a lot of caffeine that day I didn't have a lot of caffeine um, it was just super weird because um, I don't know I didn't have that much caffeine that day so I don't think it was caffeine induced um, however I don't exactly know what it was but I did have that problem when I was younger and it would literally just happen out of the blue and it would be like a little episode um, a couple other people said that it could be a panic attack um, I've had panic attacks before and it's it it's almost like it felt like a panic attack but I didn't really have any stress or anxiety changes at that time we literally sat down for lunch and it just started happening out of the blue there was no like stress change or anything and I didn't feel like panicked I guess um, it was super weird super odd but I am feeling a lot better so thank you guys so much the ones that commented and was asking about me and stuff but I'm gonna stop rambling, gonna stop talking, and get on with my knot. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoy. The house is literally such a mess right now. The bedroom's a mess. I didn't even make the bed this morning. Been trying to pack because we're going to the lake this weekend. Basically, been a mess all day long. Need to shower. I wanted to show you guys my knot time routine tonight. Oh yeah, I never actually showed you guys the guest room after I kind of completed it. So I like washed all the sheets, everything. Um, got it ready for like a guest that may want to come stay with us um, So yeah, it's actually kind of cozy in here and then it has a bathroom off to it um, I don't know if you guys know that or not, but it's a Jack and Jill bathroom. So my office is in the other side um, Super cute and then I added this a while back here in the hallway I don't know. I just feel like it kind of fits and I need to kind of clean my office up some tonight um, Especially this stuff over here. We're gonna take care of all that tonight also have some homework and stuff to do this little area right here is also something 
relatively new that I added. Um, th just this letter board and I put dream big, work hard, make it happen on there. Because I have some big dreams, I'm gonna make them happen. I'm determined. Um, this candle also smells super good from Walmart. Um, so it may burn that later, I'm not exactly sure. But I just put on this little cake stand from Target. Um, so that's this little area, I think it's super cute. So I think I'm going to start with this. These are all products that I need to organize and just kind of get out of the floor. So my idea is to put them in this drawer and then maybe some in this drawer. Um, so I'm going to work on that right now and then I'll update you guys on that. So I have my helper in here. We've been working on this. This is what we have so far. We've been doing some organizing. Um, this is what we have left. The batteries came out of this, but they're dead anyway, so need to change those out. This is like my everyday stuff, most of it. Um, so I might just like lay that in on top, but this is what I got so far. We have a potty training champ in here, washing her hands. Is that hot? <laughs> That's the cold water, silly. Uh, so Bailey's potty training. Um, yeah. How do you feel about potty training? Um, I don't know. Are you excited? Yeah. That you don't have to wear diapers anymore? Yeah, so you gotta wash your hands and then you gotta dry them and get down, okay? Okay. Okay. Dry them off. Can you reach the towel? Can you reach it? Here? It goes. Okay. My hands are good. Alright, dry your hands off. There you go. Good job. High five. Good job. Yeah, you can leave it in here for next time, okay? Yeah, I know. She was talking about her potty chair. The screw on the side came out and she fell a few minutes ago. But she's okay. She's tough, right? I think it's about time for bed. Mommy, what if the scooter came out again? I know, baby doll, I see it. Mommy, we need to fix it. Yeah, we'll fix it. So, I actually haven't showed you guys this bathroom, I don't think. I don't know, because I said I was going to redo it, and I didn't get around to painting the walls. Mommy, what, baby? Love you. Love you, honey. You're the best. <laughs> You're the best. <laughs> so, I never got around to, like, painting the walls and stuff, Um, but I did get some, like, new decor and stuff like that from Target in here, so... This shower curtain we actually already have, um, we already had in our old house, and so I just put it in here. I think it's super cute. It brightens the room up really good. Um, this basket is from Target. Super cute. This plant's from Target. Um, the hand towel's from Target, I believe, and the rug is also it's from Target. From Target. It's kind of crooked at the moment, but yeah, the, so the soap is from Walmart. Um, but yeah, it's super cute in here. I feel like it's brightened up a lot just because we added like some white in here, but I do still want to paint it, um, probably black and white to match like the color of the room. So yeah, that'll be next on the list. Good job. <laughs> Thanks baby. So anyways, um, this is what this drawer is looking like at the moment. Um, I have everything. I you, mommy, I love you first. Thank you. <laughs> Um, this is what this drawer is looking like. So this is how the drawer is looking so far. Um, I just have like some extra makeup, perfume there, um, some like skincare stuff. This basket right here is like extra stuff and um, like samples, stuff that's not opened yet. And then I just stuck my moisturizer on top there. Um, here is like lip products and stuff. Got my Glossier Bomb.com. You guys know these are my absolute favorite um, things. I really love the birthday one. I like the coconut and the mango. And then I think I have another one too. I can't remember which one it is. But yeah, these are super good. I have a link down below for 10% off the Glossier products. Their lipstick's really good. I think I have a lip gloss in there somewhere um i like their serums i'm just obsessed with glossier in general um thank you baby so um that's kind of how everything's organized right now and then this is the only thing i have left probably just gonna like stick it on top um and then when i use it every day just take it out and use my everyday makeup and hopefully it'll close that way so yeah it's gonna close super excited this drawer is super heavy now but at least like everything is kind of out of the floor. I still need to clean up a little bit. But I'm super excited that I kind of organized everything out of the way. Also, I need to hang these up here soon. Um, these are the acrylic shelves that we're going to hang in the bathroom. Probably two in each bathroom. I think I ordered six of them. These are super, super cute. Um, really excited to hang those up. So yeah, got these on Amazon. Got this six pack. I can't remember how much it was, honestly. But I'm really excited to hang these up. 
um i just have these right here for right now so yeah now it looks so much better right here literally stuff was everywhere and now it looks so good still have a few more things that i'll deal with later um i need to print some stuff off here in a second just changed the batteries in my light so i can use it now and it's right here in the perfect place right next to like my makeup so i'm super excited also if you guys are wondering these are the pages that i like to take my farm um like we have a farm binder and we do each drug um so i'm printing like 60 of these right now so that i can start on my farm binder um but these are from the Nurse Boss Essentials. I think I have these linked down below and you guys can like get the template. Um, I think it's just like a few dollars. And then I like to print them off and use them. So I'm going to print these right now. Hopefully they will print. Um, yeah, but there's like super cute like designs and stuff. And there's different ones on here. Um, I really like the plain ones though because I never know how many... Um, that I need of each one, but I do love the design ones. They're super cute And I like to print it in color because I think it's so cute. So I'll show you guys what it looks like when it comes out So it's super like subtle, but I really really like it because you can write over it so This is what it looks like Super super cute. Seriously. I love these so much. They are definitely a lifesaver. So printing out a ton of these so that I can start on my farm stuff later on. Then when it gets done, I'll probably just use like one of these and pin them all together. I think this is from Amazon. I think the gold one, I think they came separate. I had the colored paper clips and stuff and then I got a set of the gold stuff and then I just kind of mixed them together. But Amazon has some really cute sets like these. I think my mom actually got me this one. So yeah, we're getting stuff done tonight. So it is 10.55 right now. I think while this stuff is printing, I am going to go ahead and take a shower and then hopefully get some more stuff done after that, do my skincare, all that stuff, so that I can get to bed at a reasonable time tonight. Probably not because more than likely after I finish like filming all of this video, I'm going to edit it and try to get it up tomorrow. So if you guys are seeing this on Friday. Hey, it's me on Thursday, uh, <laughs> working and trying to get stuff done. I still have quite a few things to do, actually, but it's not even 11, so I feel like I'm doing pretty good. Um, if I get my shower and skincare and all that out of the way, I feel like I'll feel much better. However, I do have a lot of stuff to still work on, so maybe not, but we're going to see. almost forgot about this, but I actually have to order all of this stuff for... Bailey's birthday party. This is like most of the stuff that I have picked out. I think there's some really cute stuff in here. Amazon is actually really good for like party stuff I feel like because they honestly have so much stuff. So we're gonna have more than likely like a donut party. So I found a pinata, some like little pool floaties, um, some stuff for the kids, some like plates, cups, all that stuff, some balloons, decorations, tablecloths, all that good stuff. So more than likely going to order this stuff here in a few minutes. Still printing these. Just placed this Amazon order. It was like $170. <laughs> um, and making a list on things for Bailey's party. Also doing a couple things for like school. Like I have to update some like forms and stuff and send those in. Um, so doing that. About to shower, but I wanted to share a couple things with you guys. So this is the soap that I have been washing my face with. And I feel like it's really done a good job of like keeping um, like acne and stuff away. I still get a few spots, um, but I feel like overall it's done a really good job. And I like this because it's kind of like an antibacterial, just like a regular scented um, soap. So I love this stuff. And then in addition, or like here and there, um, I'll use the Glossier Milky Jelly Cleanser. Um, this will like forever be one of my favorites. Also, for the most part, I use my Monet shampoo. Um, I switch back and forth between like this and a, like a purple shampoo and also like my regular drugstore shampoo. So I like to switch back and forth, but this stuff seriously does a good job of like smoothing out my hair and um, like hydrating it. So I seriously love this stuff. So... Everybody went to bed, but that's just a couple of the products and stuff I use. I wanted to show you guys. So I'm going to shower really quick and then hopefully head to bed soon because I'm getting super tired. So about to do skincare, but um, this is the body lotion that I use. Seriously, so, so good. Um, you have to get the cherry almond scent. It's 
literally the best. I'm gonna go in with the facial serum tonight. Tonight I'm using the Super Bounce Hyaluronic Acid and B5 from Glossy A. Seriously love this stuff. I'm almost out actually. Um, but I really, really like this. So I'm just gonna use a little bit because that's all I have left. Um, and just kind of put it on my face. Really love this serum. Okay, so next for like my moisturizing step, I'm going to use the Rejuvenique by Monate. Love this stuff and I like to mix in a couple drops of frankincense in there. Um, frankincense is super good for your skin. It has healing properties. Um, it has a lot of benefits. You just have to look the benefits up, but I seriously love this combination so much. So I just take some of my Rejuvenique. And like squeeze it on my hand. I'm actually almost out of this stuff too. And so just like that. And then take a couple drops of the frankincense. And just kind of put on there with it. I like to do usually two or three. And then you rub that together. And just use it like a moisturizer. So just all over your face. So just depending on how much like moisturizing you want, you can put a moisturizer over top. So today I'm just going to go in with my Nivea and just kind of put it, because I know my skin has been extra dry lately. So just going to put a little bit just for some extra moisture. So next going to go in with my Lash and Brow Serum from Monate and just kind of put this on my lash line and my eyebrows. So you just put it like that and then I actually go in and rub it in after that. And then you do both eyes. Just like that. And then I'm actually working on trying to fill out my eyebrows like in this area. So I like to do that and then I just do a little swap like that. But mostly focus on this area because that's where I want my eyebrows to grow. So after I do that, then I will take my finger and just kind of rub it in a little. Like that. Okay, so now that I have all of that done, I'm ready for like my last few steps. So first I'm going to use my lip balm. This is the balm.com from Glossier that I was talking about earlier. So good. So I'm going to use that on my lips. Always like to have a moisturizer on my lips before I go to bed. And this is definitely probably my favorite. My favorite is probably the birthday cake because it's just so good. Um, so, and then I'll go in with my facial roller and just roll my face some. I feel like this just helps so much like get the blood um, like recirculating and stuff in your face and it also just feels good especially if it's cold which it is because the air conditioner has been on and this like drawer is really cold right now so really love that so I'm just gonna kind of roll my entire face and then I'll show you guys my very last step honestly it just feels so good to do this I literally could do it all day um, and then I also like to do my neck. I seriously love using this facial roller. I think mine is actually from Marshalls, but you can get them pretty much like anywhere now. Um, so after I use that, I'm going to go in with like my literal secret ingredient. You guys are going to think I'm crazy, but um, zinc actually has a ton of like antibacterial and healer, healing properties and stuff. So I'm using this butt paste on my face. Um, this is Bailey's this is a new bottle, but, um, if you think about it, it makes a lot of sense. So the zinc is like the main ingredient in butt paste and like different things. So in a hospital, like wound care nurses and stuff will use like this zinc wrap stuff to help heal the person's wound. And so when you have like breakouts and stuff, the zinc can actually help like um, take out the bacteria that causes acne in your skin. So when I have like some problem areas or breakouts, I actually just started doing this, but I'm actually seriously sold on it so I'm gonna put this on like my spots and leave it overnight and seriously works guys you seriously need to try it so I turned my light on so I could see but 
I just kind of do it like a spot treatment, but I rub it in a little bit better than just like putting it on there, I guess. Um, it kind of looks silly, but we are going to have a, a clear face and it's going to be worth it. So once it's kind of all rubbed in, you can't really tell like that much about it, I guess. Um, I did get that a little close to my eye, but yeah, so hopefully that will really help my skin and in the morning I won't have as many like noticeable breakouts, I guess. But I'm going to head to bed. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you did, be sure to hit that subscribe button, like this video, leave me a comment down below, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye! I'm not in the colors, colors